Hi guys, today we have the cafe opening in Hogwarts. Um, unfortunately, you're gonna miss Isabelle's. Oh, you might see when I go on the secondary account, but I want all my um, main accounts to scan in um, Norma so that I could order some stuff for the RV. Now I'm realizing I could have done on the secondary character, it wouldn't have mattered. Danny, Kobe, sup? I didn't realize that the Hydragas, uh, stop. I feel like it was very short because I know now it's going to be the hibiscus. Ooh, Crazy Red is here. Now you can put it on the bed. Just, I'll put it away. Just leave it with my stuff. I'll put it away later. What? Crazy Red is here. Do we have any bells on us? We don't. All right. So first things first, we got to find the money rock. I'm very sniffly today. I don't usually my allergies during the summer aren't so bad. Uh, if it gets really bad, I'm probably gonna go off screen to blow my nose so that you guys don't have to look at all that. It's only mildly disgusting. Here's a cafe. It looks pretty good next to retail. Really happy with the way it all lined up. Yeah. <laughs> Allergies are the worst. Runny noses aren't the worst. At the worst, the worst I think is when your eyes get watery. Oh my god. Seriously? Oh, I didn't do it fast enough. Okay. Oh, it's the worst. God damn it. Especially, like, if you're, like, taking a test or, like, in a really important business meeting and you're trying to present something without, uh, looking unprofessional because you have to sniff, like, every two seconds. Alright, let's find our other two fossils. Where are they? Well, here's my gem rock. Ooh, gold gem. Alright, which should I place next?
Um, not like in a like I don't think your head will explode kind of way, but probably like because like when your body is sneezing, it's trying to like expel whatever is bothering you. So I would imagine that it's like not good to leave it in your body. Do I have that bug yet? Oh, he's gonna jump off the fucking ledge, I already know it. Ah! Yep. The same thing with cloths, like... Whenever my doctor prescribes- oh, I have all my fossils. Whenever my doctor prescribes me, um, coughing- cough syrup, um, like cough suppressant, I try not to take it, um, unless I really- I'll take it, like, at night if my cough is so bad that, like, I can't sleep, so I can sleep through the night, but if it's, like, the daytime, I'd rather just, like, let my body cough and, like, you know- Expel whatever it is that's bothering me. <sighs> really, not a single fossil to donate to the museum. Let's empty our pockets. Ooh, thanks for hosting me, Danny. Oh, I should have caught that butterfly. I thought I already had it for the museum, so I didn't bother. Hey, Anka. a decent amount of bells. I well, I kind of wish that like we had a fossil to donate to the museum instead. I think it'll work tomorrow. <laughs> They're gonna be like, why are you still sniffly? They always, somebody always messes with the air in the office. And it drives me crazy. Alright, let's go to Crazy Red. Oh, there was another thingamabob. Here, I got all my tools. Alright, let's see if I can do this without consulting Tonki, but I probably will just to make sure that I am correct. Uh, the leaf one, I'm not familiar with. This one, the mountain's too big. I remember that one. This one, I think, is based off the veg. Oh, is this as close as it gets? It's based off whatever the vegetable is, which I don't remember. And then this one is something like with the hand. Again, I don't remember which one is which, but it's whether the hand is straight or the fingers are pointed up. Uh, so I guess now I'm gonna look at Tonki. And we'll see. Alright, uh, let's go in order of how Tonki has them listed, I guess. Okay, if the nose, okay, so the nose one is fake because, ew, oh, that's the nose one, okay. His nose is made of a carrot. If it's a genuine vegetable, it's a cucumber. Uh, if the painting is genuine if the nose is a, a cucumber. What else? Oh, this one. Oh, this one's hard to tell because the you gotta be able to see the leaf. 
but I'm gonna, I have to, I'm like blind, so I gotta like, <laughs> okay, if there's a hole from insects, from insects, it's fake, if there's no hole made by insects in the big leaf, it's genuine, okay, I think this is the real one, um, let's check the statue to be safe, and, if the arm is angled downward, it's fake. If it's angled upward, it's genuine. So how is his arm angled? Oh, it looks down. Right? I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you think that's down or up? Okay, I'm pretty sure it's the fruits painting, so I'm gonna buy that. The neutral painting. Oh, I didn't keep these spots up. Alright, let's go into uh, TNT Emporium. Oh, it's, it's, oh, it's probably just letting us know about the cafe. Thanks to everyone's huge generosity, a new cafe has opened in Hogwarts. We hope everyone can enjoy this relaxing new shop. Yes, okay. Falcon flavored punch. It was really hot last week. It's still hot because it's summer, but it's not like that hot now. Let me let me look it up right now. I will let you know the exact temperature outside. Oh, well, it says 86. It's pretty hot, but like compared to like the last few days, it's not so bad. Say good sorcerer, sup? I feel so stupid for buying those hydrangea bushes. I didn't realize they were so short-lived. I feel like it's much shorter compared to, like, to the other ones. I am too. I'm hoping we get something like next year. Ooh, silver watering can! Awesome! I'm still working on mine. I gotta do the scorpion too. What paths, uh, what kind of paths did you pick for your town? Nope, gotta blow my nose. Yeah, I was watching a video on YouTube, I forgot who it was, but the guy was saying that like he knows that there's like big demand for Animal Crossing Switch, but um, he doesn't, like they know there's a demand for it, and, but they've been like very vague about whether they've actually like been working on it. <laughs> it took me four days to use uh, yeah, it's really hard to find paths that you like. I feel like I see, like, a lot of good pictures online. But it's, like, really difficult to actually, like, find, um, I lied. I'm gonna, like, dab my nose on screen. It's really hard to, like, like, you see good ones, but it's hard to find, like, the QR codes, like, the source of where it came from, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Oh, wow, my pockets are full. Hey, Gracie. 
we're gonna go to Potter really quick to do the daily, uh, you know, money rock for him. Pay off his home loan. Uh, there were no chess pieces in TNT Emporium. They're like really hard to come. I like. I knew they were rare, but I didn't like. I thought I would at least be able to get the freaking pawn piece by now. Like that's like the most common one. Yes! Oh, here. We finally gotten what everyone in Hogwarts has been asking for, our own cafe. I'll admit it, I stepped away and went there, and the coffee was absolutely delish. I think I'll be going there a lot, so if you ever see me inside, be sure to say hello, okay? Okay, that's cute. Uh, yeah, I actually, I found one that I really did like, and... This is even worse. I found the first ha it was a multi, like, QR code, which, that wasn't my problem. I could only find the first half of the fucking QR codes. The first half. That was it. Coffee. Oh. <laughs> that Brooklyn accent coming through. Why? I don't understand why, like, I can do it, like, with the normal freaking shelf, not the silver one. Maybe I should start, like, with him, just so that, like, I can practice <laughs> by the time I get, oh, okay, I gotta fix that. God damn it. <laughs> no, the good thing is, the first rock that I checked was the money rock on this guy. To be honest, I think my main issue, my main concern, is rubbing off my nose contour. Alright, um... I can go now and pay off my house. So, no chess pieces. Um, we're gonna check out the cafe tonight. Probably do a... Mm, Maybe we'll see based on how much time if we're going to do some path work for the cafe since it was just placed. Place another public works project. And I have Norma scanned and I want to order a couple things for the house. Um, if people want to come over and like visit her, um, I'll open my gates for that. If it's if like not, I'm not going to have time to like play with anyone tonight, but if they want to drop by and order stuff from her RV, you can look it up, what she has. If you want something, you guys can uh, take a quick visit. I want to use the bathroom. I'll be right back.
Gabe, sup? Oh yeah, Sacred Sorcerer, I just remembered. Didn't you started following me when I had that like horrible cough? Now the issue is my nose. Oh yeah, Gabe, I still have your painting if you want to come pick it up. Thank you, Falcon Flavor Punch. <laughs> Gaming wish alt. I wouldn't unfriend people unless like I see like I do it like on my main um on my personal 3DS. If I see people that haven't been on in like a very long time, I will remove them. I did add you, I think. I am sick all the time. People think it's weird that I get sick during the summer, but I work like a corporate job in an office where the air conditioning is constantly running so I get sick at least twice during the summer it's called an air condition my doctor told me it's called like an air conditioner cold uh, because you're in the office and it's running all day and it's cold because our bodies aren't supposed to like when it's like freaking fucking 95 degrees outside you're not supposed to go into like 72 degree weather that fast Phineas Alright, there's a lot going on in town today, guys. I mean, I have a badge. Ho ho. Ark, ark, ark. It seems you like getting your furniture custom at the recycle shop. I think it's wonderful how often you like to change things up and live life with some adventure. I've got the perfect badge for you. If you keep being good, the badge man will bring you a new badge, okay? I'm a little surprised that we got this one so fast. That's it. One badge. Fine, Phineas. I will be opening them in a minute. Ooh, counter seat. Ah, my pockets are full. I forgot. Of course, I finally catch a transfer after days and the day after one of my movies. Oh no, I'm still working on that, so um, you can watch me suffer, I guess. I was very confused. I love Vladimir. He's oh, is he like he is he a bear? I feel it right. He's got like he's definitely a bear. Oh, is he a pink giant bear? Oh, I was correct. I know my fucking Animal Crossing. I don't know what would that be called trivia. Seven thirty. Seven thirty. Seven. Oh yeah, because of the thing. No, bear cubs are like the little ones. And then bears are like the big, like a bear you would counter like in a forest or some sh I don't know. Some shit like that. Right? Oh, he's little? Is he? Like a stuffed animal? No, that's a regular bear. Bear cub, like, Stitches is a bear cub. Because, you know, like, he's like a stuffed animal. Like, little. Is he? Does he? What? What? I'm, okay, I need to I need to look at pictures of him, like... Uh, no, he looks normal. Like, compared to Stitches? Oh. I don't know. Wait, okay. Let's see what Wiki says. Oh, sir, you are correct. I stand corrected. 
He is a small. He is small. <laughs> He's a small bean. No, but just because I thought he was like a cranky. Yeah, he is cranky. So I thought that they would have made him bigger, like some of the other cranky uh, bears, but they made him like small and angry. Counter C. Okay, this is for one of the rooms. Apart. I was like, he doesn't. Do they become small? No, you're right. He apparently yeah. So he's in the same category that I was saying that like stitches and Junar bear cubs are like. I was gonna say he's got like like. Small people have like fucking like Napoleon complexes. <laughs> but I love the bear cubs. I have three bear cubs in my main town and a koala, which I think koalas get their own classification, but I still feel like he fits in that small bear category. And then in my second town, I have maple. Who is a bear? This is my only town without a bear cub, and that's because, like, this town is, like, supposed to be themed after, like, Hogwarts. Okay, so this says, Norma's so proud of her artisan dairy products that she always brings plenty of samples when she goes camping or anywhere, really. Okay. So. Um, I actually wanted a stone tile instead of the basement floor. Okay, what, okay, so the first thing, I'm gonna buy the milk carton, I'm gonna, you can get this custom to orange juice, which, um, we're gonna pretend that it's pumpkin juice. The mug, I saw a really cool QR code where they did the mug, um, so that it looks like butterbeer, so that will be cool for some of the rooms, uh, we can order one more thing. I'm debating if I want cheese or the basement floor. Right. Or maybe I should get another milk canister. No, okay. Oh, this doesn't work. But you can get that from Harvey. Mm, Alright, we're gonna go with cheese. It's because I love cheese. Sorry about that, guys. Um, Gabe, I'm going to grab your painting and open the gates. Actually, instead of 5K, if you have a stone tile or any chess pieces, I'll take that from you and over bells. Oh, my God, guys. Maybe I, I thought it was allergies this morning. Maybe I am getting sick. I hope not. Oh my god, normally I don't edit my YouTube videos when these go on my YouTube channel, but I feel like I should. Alright, you know let me open the gate. No, I get sick in the winter too, but I don't know about how the weather is like for you, but New York winters are brutal. Aww. 
I actually, I went to my friend's birthday party this Saturday at an outdoor, like, Mexican bar thing. It was really nice. Actually, it cooled down a lot. Like, literally, like, the day before. Okay, my gate's open, Gabe. Um, but the day before, we were, it was so hot. You were dying because of the heat. And then it had cooled down to, like, at night. I had, a, I wore a leather jacket. I, that's why you're sick always during the summer. Your body's not used to it. My body, like, in New York, you get all four seasons in, like, one day. Um... You know what? I will take a toy hammer because you can hit the villagers with it and it, it, it makes me laugh to be mean to them. Did I not? Okay, um, give me your friend code now and I will uh, add you. Would anyone else like to visit Norma? Uh, while the gates are gonna be open. Julian! Okay. I was watching a vlog of this girl, I forgot her name, but she like went to Scotland, I think, like, for winter, and it was like so nice and pretty. She did like vlogmas. Whoa, I'm so jealous. Oh, why did I... I didn't want to time travel. I wanted to add someone. I Because I was time traveling in my main town today, trying to fix shit. I think that's why. <laughs> no, go, go back to the regular date. <laughs> Autopilot is dangerous. It's hard. I'm like, I have some that people gave me as gifts. I got really lucky that I got some good villagers, um, like Whitney and Marshall. Oh, I really, I love Whitney. Marshall, I have him in my uh, second town because he, like, fits the theme. I really, I really want to be able to trade today. There we go. But amiibo cards can be like, they're hard to find now. I think you can buy the packs individually expensive uh, for pretty cheap. But if you want like a specific villager, they get pretty like expensive. Um, if you watch my streams from the beginning, you know that I just, to get the villagers I wanted, I just um, reset for everyone. It wasn't that bad actually. Gabe, your friend code isn't working. Can you please double check it? But, yeah, I feel like it's such an expensive hobby. Even if you buy the packets, like, because I don't think Animal Crossing did, like, they said that it was equal distribution among the, like, villagers. Yeah, see, like, I can't. That's a, what is that? What is 11 euros convert to an American in, in USD? That's $12.92. That is a burrito bowl from Chipotle plus guac! Plus guac! I can't. <laughs> Bunny is really cute though.
I bought one from the Nintendo store for my friend in Hawaii. Yeah, that's like a big plus in guac included. That's a big deal. If it's 15 USD, that's plus guac and chips. Oh, I looked up Julian because he was one of the first people that I reset for when I started the series. And he goes for freaking 25, 25 USD. Yeah, I don't know why, like, I hate that Autobot does that. Uh, my, uh, the, my ma does, apparently, because Anka moved out of his town, and he was so devastated, he went and bought her card, and it was, like, 25 USD. <laughs> I can't. That's two burrito bowls plus guac! I just every time like somebody says like something expensive, I'm gonna I'm gonna like I'm gonna tell them how many burrito bowls they can buy plus guac. That's gonna be the new. That's gonna be our new thing. Mmm, I love Chipotle's chips because. They, like, sprinkle them with, like, lime juice and put salt on top. So if you get, like, I love when you get, like, a chip that has, like, all the, like, where there was, like, a big, like, uh, you could tell there was, like, a lot of lime juice on that part and, like, the salt adheres to it. Honestly, the only thing that, like, I really, like, am a, that I really, like, like from Chipotle when I'm craving it is their chips. Their rice is pretty good, too, because it's cooked with, like, lime and cilantro. So, um, I feel like I should just learn how to make it, because it's not worth it to get, like, because, like, the, the filler, like, you know, like, tomatoes, okay, you know, you can, like, how hard is it make, pick, uh, I can't say it, whatever, peat, the gallo, I don't know. <laughs> Lamont is probably watching this, and he's like, oh my god, Kathy. Uh, but the point is, the main thing, really, like, one of my main cravings from there is the rice. <sighs> Taco. <gasps> you guys have... Wait, so have you had Chipotle before? Oh. Rosetti! <laughs> Taco Bell is so bad for you. <laughs> but it's so good. Wait. Did you try the Dorito Taco? No, it's probably me. When you say dead, do you mean like the stream's not... Like that you're the only one talking? Or do you mean like... Is my stream... Am I like talking to nobody right now? Okay, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to open the door so that the connection uh, is stronger.
Okay, I'm back. Hopefully, Gabe can uh, get through this time. Oops, wrong thing. Okay. Do I have his painting at least? Can't just see. Oh, I don't have the painting. Okay. Well, while he comes, I'm gonna go put my stuff away and get the painting. Is my stream dead? Because nobody's seeing anything. Well, I think it's Russia. You're like me and you spell Chipotle the way it's pronounced. <laughs> Nice outfit. Counter seat. Oh, here's a nice painting. Okay, I am coming to the train station. There you are. Okay. Right there is your painting. Is something wrong with it?
Hey guys, no idea what happened, uh, but I am back. Is Gabe still here? I am back! I, I don't know, according to the mod I ended the stream by mistake, but I didn't, I didn't touch the button, I swear! <laughs> There were a lot- there's a lot of gyroids today. Oh, it's the pitfall state. Okay, I can plant this one back and hopefully none of my other villagers, um, fall in it. Did I not water my hybrids last time I was here? I feel like I did. Maybe I didn't, because apparently I ended the stream without realizing. Um gonna go here and bury it uh, let me close my gate Okay, enjoy. <laughs> Be safe. Alright, um, okay, so I'm gonna open another window. Oh, didn't have to be like that, but okay. I'm gonna drag it over here so that I can Google Tre treasure chest. Thank you. I think I'm coming down with the summer. I, this morning when I woke up, I thought I had allergies, but uh, I think I am coming down with a summer cold. Oh yeah, I checked that already. It's a freaking butterfly. Okay. Um. There you go. Hey, 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 Cookie, it's a perfect weather for chill inside. Anyway, did you need some? Hey, this is kind of some. Um, sure, let's go to Drago's house. Why not? This is it, let's go in. Um, hi, Gabe. To Apparently, I accidentally ended it by mistake. I was gonna offer you some nice peach nectar, but I drank it all. I hope you're okay with that. My bad plaid shirt is my go to outfit I wear on special occasions, like on days where lots of huge peach crop turns ripe. I apologize when I'm fresh out of almond jelly. He's got two- what? They lied! They said that he would not put two of these, or, or maybe because I gave him, like, one goldfish. It did? Oh, okay, I'll let you... Do I so uh, yep, I have the freaking counter seat. Okay. Let me open again. Um... It's not- I'm gonna give him to make him happy. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Thanks for the compliment. It makes me feel twice as tall. I can't wait for the Happy Home Academy to come judge my place now. Burn. Bye now, cookie. 
Next time, let's hang out at your place. Okay. Did you, wait? Did you get your painting? What else did? No, I didn't. Okay, do you want to try it again? Just so you, that you can get it really quick. Did I put it on the ground? I just have to open the door again. But. Right. Third time, the charm, hopefully. Pave chest, dartboard, ISR. This is where it was before. Oh, it must have kicked you off after. It must have, like, kicked you off after you picked it up. Alright, I will open. I'm gonna open this gate, and then I'm gonna open the actual door to this room so that the connection is not shitty. Thanks for the follow, Metaton! Animal Crossing is the best. How long have you been playing? Okay. Yeah, when Gabe said stream was dead, I couldn't tell if he meant that, like, the actual stream had cut off, or if he meant, like, there wasn't that many people, like, in the room. Alright, Gabe is on his way. God damn it. Um, I don't think the Wi-Fi connection is stable enough for that. And, um, I have a few other things I want to do around town, so I don't think I'm going to be able to do it today. The worst feeling ever is when you feel like you have to sneeze and then it doesn't come out. Literally, the worst. It's
Is it themed after anything? Oh my god. I can't. It's so unsatisfying because then you're left with like that weird face and like you're trying to like coax it out but it it won't come out. Motherfucker! Right, if it doesn't work this time, I'm gonna have to do it another day because I don't want to waste too much time. Oh, not do that. Actually, Gabe, maybe you should open your gate and I'll try. Alright, if this doesn't work, I'll try coming to you. Oh, I can't work because you have to like, gain Baldur's trust. <sighs> Alright, I guess we're gonna have to do another day, Gabe, because the Wi-Fi hates me. I, like, I don't have a good... <laughs> Alright, let's take this counter seat to Cyrus and have him customize it. You can try, but I think I got like an internet message. I didn't read it. I, it's probably why I never know what's going on with the fucking Wi-Fi. Because the minute it doesn't work, I'm like, eh, okay, it's not working. I'm not going to mess around with the router. See what other colors he has. Let's go with black for now. Gabe, do you change it each year? <laughs> like you play your town for a whole entire year and then you restart it? Yeah, you do. You get a lot of money actually when you if you take them to Blathers and you get them assessed, you get more money than if you just sold them from digging them up from the ground. Ooh, did you just start your town or something? What was I doing? What was I doing? Uh, I can't remember what I was going to do. Well, there's it's here. <laughs> yep, I'm going right now. Ooh, what part of New York do you live in? Is 
If you say Staten Island, I'm gonna have to ban you from my stream. <laughs> oh, awesome. Yay, so apparently, I accidentally ended the stream. I swear to God, I didn't click it, but I don't know. A ghost lives in the house or something. No, it doesn't work. Okay, it's not happening. We're going to the cafe. Connection. God damn it. Alright, yeah, it's not working. I'm sorry. We're gonna have to try. I'm either gonna have to try another day or I'm probably gonna have to try not on stream because I think streaming, the problem is that streaming takes up like a shit ton of the bandwidth. Um, just to make sure. Alright guys, hopefully this is the last 
of the technical problems that we will have. Uh, there's probably like a bunch of fucking videos on my page because I like, fucked up. Isn't there? Oh my god, okay, there's fucking, there's a 39 minute video, and then a 15 minute one, and then this one that just started. See a balloon. I found the fucking pitfall seed that I had buried. I should find a new outfit. Balloon TV. Don't want it. I meant to go on retail. I sent you a Oh, I didn't go to Shrunk. I'll probably do that. Uh, Balloon TV, don't want it. Let's go to the house, empty our pockets, and then I'm probably gonna order a few things. Oh, I didn't look at the wall and floor, p floor ring of t Timmy and Tommy's. Uh, so I need one, two, three, f wait, no, one, two, three, four, five, six. Alright, six tables at least. Are you on the island? Oh yeah, you didn't hear me asking because I got disconnected. Have you ever tried the Dorito Taco from Taco Bell? Did you do the trick where you only plant two palm trees? Oh my god, it's so, it's so disgusting, but it's so good. 
that's like the only to be honest that's like the only time where you should probably be eating something like that bad for you <laughs> really i heard people are saying that like it's easier when you only have two palm trees because it's those are the only true two trees that it like could possibly be on so it makes like looking for it easier um i did it in my town i don't know if it helped or hurt <laughs> so i'm just gonna but because people said that it's helpful um i'm gonna leave it like that Wait, so I have a question. Have you have you had Chipotle before? If there's, like, none in your country? Yeah, that's what I said. And then everybody was like, oh, yeah, it helps. So I'm like, I don't know if it does, but I'm like, well, if the internet said it, it must be true, right? <laughs> Some people even cut down, like, the, the, um, the one... That goes on like the middle part, the f the fruit tree is that what it's called? Um, so that nothing can spawn on the fruit tree either. I didn't go that far, but I only I left one fruit tree up so that I can catch like bugs that show up on that tree. I didn't go to shrunk. God, I have such a short attention span. Really? I crave it like literally like once a year. I'll be like, I want a burrito bowl, but honestly, like I said. It's the chips. Ah, uh, a perfect peach. I love these so much. Yum yum time snack. Mmm, yum. Oh my goodness, thanks a bunch. Now I need to thank you since you gave me such a delicious treat. Mm, then how about I tell you a really good joke today? Thank you, thank you. Dr. Strunk is in the house. My surprise joke is just the thing to cure what ails you. The other day, I bought a bag of potato chips. I was happily munching on them when I noticed Paxi said, Now with real potato flavor. Hey, I love real potatoes. So what I've been eating all these years. That's what I said when McDonald's came out with their, like, commerce something. Now made with 100% real cheese. I was like, what were you feeding me before? This is why I don't eat fast food anymore. Let's see if Able Sisters have anything good. <laughs> yeah, exactly. This is why I'm like, whenever I want, like, Generally speaking, when I want Mexican food, there's better restaurants or like even the taco trucks. Like, there's some really good ones around here. But it's I'm telling you, it's the chips. <laughs> they get me every time. Uh, this shirt's pretty. This shirt would be cool to use as a design. I think I'll wear it. Yeah, actually. I want you guys to see that the shirt matches the th my personal 3DS <laughs> that I use um, to play games in bed with when I'm not streaming. McDonald's has chips? Oh, no, you're European, so for you, chips are french fries. Not like potato chips. I guess I'll put this shirt in my closet. My walk-in closet, and by that I mean uh, that m room in the museum I haven't bothered to clean out yet. 
Yeah, at first I thought, because I know, like, in other countries that McDonald's has, like, different foods. Like, in Japan, you can get, like, a teriyaki burger or whatever. So I was like, it's plausible that something they have for you guys. And then I was like, oh, no, wait. They're European. <laughs> Us Americans, we were like, fuck you, mom and dad. <laughs> Display. Yeah, this is fine for now. I only changed my shirt. Very half assed. The Glyph ones are worth a good amount, no? Are you, were you looking for something specific, like to fill up your museum or something? Alright guys, finally, we're going to the cafe. Oh, I didn't know that. I usually, I'll just catch like a big beetle. Which one is that one? Goliath. Oh, that's a red one. That makes more sense because I feel like they are more common. Yay, thank you Evan for renewing your subscription. <laughs> Third month in a row. Okay, let's go get some coffee. Coffee is 200 bells a cup. One, please. Brewster, why don't you have iced coffee? It's the middle of the summer. Marshall Crossing. Sup? Marshall's, I have Marshall in my second town. He's a cutie. He's got funny eyebrows. Did you have, did you reset for him? A special to coffee, cool. Go ahead and enjoy. Thank you. Cause he likes it when you drink it burning hot. Um, uh, it has just the right sting. It tastes so sophisticated. Two, thank you. All right. Ooh, did he plot in a good spot? Alright. Today all right, I lied. We are not going to work on paths. I am probably gonna be like Sacred Sorcerer and oops. Go to the island and do some beetle farming. Oh, let's talk to some of our villagers. Wait, did you not know that he was moving in? Hey, good to see you. Nice time to get out and around in Hogwarts. Rough rough. Impeccable timing, Kathy. If you go to Bruce's place, uh, sh sure. I will deliver a package to Bruce. Bruce, are you home? You're not home. Okay. Uh, Phoebe. Oh, you got lucky. Imagine if he would have moved in, like, right in front of your house. Right in front. I see Bruce. All right, I want to ask you, do you think you bring me a piece of fruit? I'm cutting out candy and subbing in fruit. I love it. But if I get myself, I always end up eating too much, so I ask someone else to get it for me. Any kind would do. One piece of fresh fruit, that's a lot. Sure. Bruce. Am I the only person that thinks it's really mean? That they know that they named a horse Elmer as an Elmer's Lou, which they use horses to make. <laughs> Hi.
Huh, a package for me was sent to Wolfling by mistake? Why? Huh, I wonder what it is. Well, I remember now. It's that. Oops, I forgot I asked, so I bought it already. I have an idea. Would you like... Sure. It's mean! Actually, there is a villager in this game. Actually, there was a pig that moved in front of my house. His name is Rasher. And I was so pissed off because he moved, like, right in front. Like... Like, in real life, if you move three steps, if you place your house three steps away from the mayor's house, I'm pretty sure there are going to be problems. But anyway, when I found it was a pig, his name is Rashet, when I found out that, like, it's a type of bacon, I was, like, so satisfied. I was like, ah! In your face, stupid pig. I'm thinking about redecorating one, replace my cassette player. Yeah, maybe I'll get another piece of furniture. Do you have any really good recommendations for me? Um, all right, we'll try to find something. Oh, Phoebe wanted a piece of fruit. We'll give her. Let's see what Bruce sold us. A fern shirt! That is not what I wanted. Hmm, looks good. Alright, I'm gonna eat it right now. Wow, so good. I might even say this perfect peach is way too good. You found this in Hogwarts? Above and beyond, dude. My gift in return doesn't do it justice. What is she giving me? Check it. It's a flower chair. Ah, oh, it's cute. Hi, Marshall. Hey, Marshall Cross. Okay, so... I'm not going to be doing online play today, and priority for online play goes to subs and then followers when I am doing it. Alright, let me go sell that fern shirt because I don't want it or need it. Fern and oh yeah, and the flower chair. Oh, that's the worst because you're like, because nothing good is coming up, so you're walking like normal pace, and then you see something like a hint of gold flash, and you're like, ah! Because the gold ones, I think, are worth like twelve thousand bells or something. Thank you for following Marshall Crossing. Um, next time I do online playing you will have well between like I said subs and then followers I'm going to make it a little later so that I can get some good beetles. Cheating the system! Thank you for following. <laughs> what time is it? Uh, 6, 7, 8? Eight. 8 should be good. Marshall, have you been to the Marshall themed town? The dream address? Did you, um, oh, hit max spells? Oh, okay. I thought you hit max spells. Um,. You technically can, I think. You just have to be careful, like, um, you just have to be careful. You gotta make sure you t go day by day and make sure you talk to all your villagers. Lolly, she's really cute. 
You got lucky, because Lolly is a super popular one, I'm pretty sure. Let's see what her eBay amiibo goes for. Sixteen USD. That's a lot. That's two burrito bowls with guac. <laughs> or you could sell her for two burrito bowls and guac. And yes, there is a Marshall themed town. Um, it's a little disturbing. Oh, should I should I visit? Oh, like twenty five USD. I'm pretty sure because that's how much Julie and Anka were. Yeah, twenty five USD. What? Fifty? Get the fuck out of here! What was I doing? Oh, yeah, Marshall. It is a lot. I can't afford that shit. I gotta pay for my fucking rent. Marshall. Okay, I found the old. The problem is that, like. The problem is that, like, I found the dream address. One of. But this is, like, I don't know if whoever made it, like, updated her town after. Uh, list of dream addresses. Yeah. When did welcome? When did the milk? When did the welcome amiibo update? Uh. Did she literally just name it Marshalltown? I'm like trying to find it. You have a dupe. Who's you have a dupe of who? Marshall's amiibo. Oh, okay. Um, I don't know. If I had two of Marshall, I would. I would have definitely sold the second one to pay the fucking rent. <laughs> Oh, yeah. this is from a year ago. No, damn it! I really wish that Nintendo hadn't taken it off. Um, I don't think there's like a singular like more popular village than the others, but going based on the prices I've seen for like what amiibos go for. Julian was 25, Marshall was 25, um, Anka was 25, Diana was 25. I think basically any amiibo that will sell for like $25 on eBay, that, that's it. It would help if, like, people actually knew, like, what the name of the town was for the Marshall-themed town. <laughs> yes. Do you want Whitney? I actually have her amiibo card. Twelve USD. That's not so bad. 
Like, I still feel like it's a lot. Oh, no, but some people, it's, like, random. So you can find her for as low as 12. And then some people have her going up to, like, 20. Oh, she's cute. I like Whitney. No, it's, they didn't hack it. Actually, I've heard of that town where they hacked it to have 10 marshals. This person just, like, the flag is Marshall, the, like, QR, like, the paths are Marshall. I'm, like, wasting my time, like, looking this shit up when I should be, like, uh. I should be beetle grinding. But, you know. Okay. This is unhelpful because literally, like, all these people are, like, oh, it's a Marshall-themed town. Here's the dream address. But they don't actually say the name of the town. I want to visit, like, on stream, because I feel like it would be, like, a very funny, like, experience. I can't find it. Can't find it! All these, like, hard, let's see, hard towns. Oh, this is old! Give me the updated one. I get a feeling that this person has it updated, because when you search Akai Villages... It comes up. Ant-Man was super good, guys. You gotta go fucking see it. It was the best. It was one of, like, the best movies I'd ever seen. I didn't expect it to like it so much because the first Ant-Man, I thought it was it was just okay. Um, you know? I Like, because I couldn't even remember. I couldn't recall any of, like, the storylines from the first Ant-Man. But this one was so good. It was filled with action sci-fi, comedy, all that. I don't do horror movies. Um, okay. So I can't find the actual dream address. I'm just gonna send you guys a link to some random guy on YouTube um, who went to visit the town. That's, that's the best I can do. So, is it? No, I can't. I don't. So for me, when I watch, I'm. I am. I won't lie. Like I am a little bitch when it comes to like watching horror movies. Like people complain because they're like your reaction is scarier than the fucking movie, which is fair. Um, but the thing for me is like when I go home at night. And I'm trying to fucking sleep, and, like, I hear the leaves, or, like, if one of my roommates gets up to use the fucking bathroom, and I hear them, well, okay, I can't do it. Yeah! Save! We're in the little bitches club together. Oh, I accidentally turned off the sound. You're lucky I have so much hair. No. <laughs> I hate having this much hair. Did you fill up your box? Are any of you looking at the video on the Marshall themed town? I'm not watching it, but I'm like clicking through it randomly. I don't remember if this is the same one I went to. You'll know if this is the one I'm talking about. If next to the bed, all I'm going to say is that there's a box of tissues. <laughs> <sighs> Make of that whatever you will after a slug of fighting with beetles. Yes. Time to pay off those home loans. 
Uh, did I? I'm gonna be so pissed if I forgot to empty my box. <laughs> okay. I am not as dumb as I thought. Do you feel like the two palm tree or one pa whatever trick helped you? Yeah, that's how I feel. I don't, I feel like it, if it did make a difference, it didn't make big enough a difference for it to be like, wow, like, beetle catching is so much easier, but people said it would help. So I did it because the internet told me to. Uh, that's a good reason to do things, right? Because the internet said to. No beetles are showing up! Oh, nobody said anything for a while. Did my stream cut off again? I hope not. No, I'm still streaming. Okay. The reason I have one on the grass is because um, I just started this town in April, so I'm still missing some bugs like the oak silk moth, which can only be caught on that tree. Otherwise, you can see I only have like two palm trees. I think this one is only worth 6k, but I'm gonna catch it. No, it's okay. <laughs> Fruit beetles! Oh, did I catch all the sharks? I don't know. If I didn't, I'll find out eventually when I catch another one. Oh, it is? So, Goliath, I saw Goliath beetle is the only one that's like 6k, I guess. Ooh. I did not know that. Okay. Can you guys tell that uh, math was my worst subject in high school? <laughs> I'm not good with math. I know the golden ones are worth like the most and I know the horned elephant and the other the big black one I know those are worth like a good amount but I thought Goli the Goliath and the Cyclomutta or whatever that one the one where like it says tweezers or whatever I thought that one was 6k yeah horned atlas that's the big black one that's what she said <laughs> oh twitch please don't ban me Ooh, look at that
which can suck my left nut. Sacred Sorcerer, you also followed me. I think you the stream that you found me on was when I was like playing Mario Kart, and then somebody got like butt hurt because of auto auto mod was on. We didn't know how to use it back then, so they went and reported me, and Twitch put me on a 24-hour suspension. And then I was sick for like two months <laughs> with my cough. But they came down fast with the ban hammer, like, super, because I think, like, he had only been in my stream for five minutes. So it took them five minutes from him reporting me, and then, so, like, I wonder, like, if it was, like, a computer that, like, um, just auto-automatically, like, suspended me, or if it was, like, if an actual person looked at this and was like, yes, this outfit is inappropriate. I mean, remember that because I like raged about it and I kept being like, I got banned! And the mods were like, You didn't get banned, you were suspended. And I was like, Semantics! I'm angry! <laughs> oh, get back here. Are we catching the butterflies to sell to like that little girl? They can suck my left nut. Well, after that happened, me and the mod, we went and we read, like, the terms of service to see, like, what we violated specifically on, like, how to avoid it. Um, but Twitch is, like, if you read their terms of service, we read that thing, like, so many times from top to bottom. Twitch is, like, purposely, like, Super vague about what is or is not okay. It's pretty decent, actually. I know some people go and they only catch sharks, but I feel like that takes too long. Ooh, I burped. Sorry, guys. No sharks. No beetles either, what the hell? The butterflies aren't worth that much, so I just like catching them because it's like... They're fun to do. Don't worry, I would never sell her my beetles. I thought it was like half! Um, yeah, that's the thing, because I, uh, fill up my locker space with beetles, I just sell them to her because, like, it makes her happy. I don't know. I get weirdly attached to, like, Animal Crossing people, cat Animal Crossing characters. The mod makes fun of me because he wants me to skip Captain's song, but he gets so mad when you do it. I feel bad. Oh, here's a shark. But see, I'm bad at math, so I believed you. <laughs> Oh, it's an ocean sunfish. Okay. I believe these sell for maybe 8 or 10k? Yeah, he gets so mad. I feel, I feel bad. So I just... When I go to the island, I let him sing. Unless it's like, I'll skip it if I'm island hopping. Uh, just cause, you know, if I, if I spend like all day doing that, it'll drive me crazy. 
But if I'm just going to the island to like grind for uh, bells, I will let him sing the song. <laughs> Spicy memes blaze. Sup? Ouch. Do you at least already have one for your museum? Did you catch a scorpion yet? I haven't, so that means that I need to catch it. Oh, fancy. Thanks for the follow, spicy memes, please. Share your memes with me on Discord. <laughs> I love memes. I don't have any of those. I don't have either the scorpion or the trancha, so I feel if I have enough time, I might uh, try to walk around town a little bit and uh, try to catch one. I feel the reason I thought that this one was only 6k is because I feel like this one doesn't scare as easily as the horn atlas. Rainbow stag is the one that shows up on this tree, right? The fruit one? The poofy one? So technical, Kathy. I would assume that the ones that are like the same cost would be about the same sensitivity. I have not. I've been tempted to do a whole box. Excuse me. A whole box of sharks before. But I haven't done it. That sounds like a fun stream. If I'm not like, maybe like on a day where, ooh, where I'm not working, like a whole box of golden stags. Before I, let's see how long it takes before like I go crazy. Oh my god, yes! Nintendo is a giant troll. How long did it take you? God, what, what? He was stubborn. That's impressive. You were super dedicated. That was definitely like a golden, one of the golden ones I scared away, alright. The good thing about buying the hibiscus starts on the island is that it's not like in TNT Emporium where there's only one of them. You can buy like multiple of them. Multiples? I like flip flop like back and forth on like how much I want to cheat on this channel. <laughs> would it make it e would it really make a difference if it was on the side? Time travel twenty years.
I feel like it. I think I feel like he's right that it would be easier, just because since mine is all the way at the south part of the map, that I wouldn't have to run so much. But like I vaguely recall the guy that I read on Beetle Farming told me to put it at the southern part of the map, so like I I did it. <laughs> Right. I'm gonna listen to you guys, and well, I can't chop them down right now because those are my only two trees. Fuck. Um, but I will plant them to the side, and then once they're grown, I'll chop those other ones down. Damn it. Really? Oh, maybe that's what they said, and I mis recalled what it said. Alright, let's shake this tree. So, like. Is this a good spot? Is this like where the guide said to do it? I feel like as an Animal Crossing streamer, I should know. <laughs> I killed my flower. Oh, it's okay. Ooh, butterfly. More up. Get back here. Oh, well, you guys are gonna run so much better than I do. Okay. Like. Here. Okay, let's do one here. And then I guess I would plant like, um, tell us your current list of villagers. I thought you already had Marshall in your town because you have two of his amiibo cards. Do you have a balanced, um, like all the personality types? I feel like I should do like an amiibo collection video one day. I don't have that many though, so I feel like it would be really short. My favorite Uchi is Phoebe. Wait, isn't... Timmy and Tommy, I'm trying to like, I feel like I probably would like, especially since they've been going on sale, I would collect all the like plastic figurines, but I don't know about the cards, like, getting all the cards sounds like a lot of work. Phoebe is my favorite, I have her in my town actually. I also have, um, in my main town, I'm... I have Mira, who's the... She's like a Sailor Moon-themed bunny. 
Shari. I used to like when Shari. I hated Shari when she moved into my town. Just cause it's a monkey in like drag makeup and a diaper. Like, what is she wearing? But after I saw like Chugga Conroy's video of her, she had already moved out of my town. But I like she grew on me. I felt bad for being so mean to her. But in my defense. She did plop her house, like, right in front of my cafe. Phoebe's cool, though. One of my friends... Ron, I gave him Phoebe for my um, main town to make room for Mira because, and I ended up putting Phoebe back in this town because it works because um, she's like she's supposed to be like a phoenix, but he also has like he also has Blanche and Flora in his town, so they all look super cute together because they're all ostriches, I think. Ooh. It's interesting to see who Nintendo thinks will be like there's mo their most popular villagers versus like who actually online like in the gaming community is popular because when you go into the Nintendo, the only villages that they made for like um, stuffed animals were Fauna, Rosie, and Bunny, and they're popular enough. But I feel like there's like Marshall's. I feel like is way more popular than the both of them. Ooh, was that a shark? Am I seeing things? Oh, it's a shark! I almost ran, scared it away. That would have been bad. Oh, it's not a shark because it only. Oh, what? It was! I caught a shark in one bite! I'm surprised. Oh, well, shark. Okay. Love. Don't feel attacked. <laughs> That makes sense. <laughs> Beetle. My box is filling up. Hopefully, moving them to the side will next time I do this, they'll be faster. I'm kind of disappointed we didn't find, like, the steak, the Marshall-themed town, because I feel like this is, like, the one time I would have visited a town here live. Um, I'm in water. Yeah. 
My nose is very runny. Also, this bill is very bitter. <laughs> These people probably think I'm like, I shouldn't mute myself. With No, is it a cute villager at least? Is it Marshall? <laughs> Who did you kick out for him? Unless you only had nine villagers to begin with. Oh, I see, I see. But this is why I cover my town, like, with QR codes, so that, like, nobody can move into, like, a bad spot in my town. Because that was, like... The thing that drove me crazy about New Leaf. Yeah, until I get like all ten of the village, my dreamies or whatever, I tile the whole entire town. I love plot resetting. How do you think I got my villagers like into such neat little rows? <laughs> But everybody plays differently. And then, like, some people, like, they don't, like, go crazy plot resetting like I do, but I know they'll do it so that at least, like, the villager won't move in front of their house or something. Oh, so do you have a map where the river divides it, like, in half so that you can place all of them at the bottom? It doesn't have to be one row for me, but they do have to be, like, lined up neatly. Ah, fuck! Can't believe I scared it away. You can tell when it's, like, a golden one, too, because of the color. Oh, I see a lantern fly. Oh, am I gonna scare away that 
Oh no, he's done. I can't remember if I caught a lanternfly yet for this town. I feel like I might have and sold it by mistake. Oh, he has sold a lantern fire. Wait, so what do you do? You whip it out at the last second? That doesn't scare them away. Your oh, there's bananas! Your I hate bananas. <laughs> Wait, look, guys, do you see this? I'm gonna eat everything <laughs> but the fucking bananas because I'm a weirdo. If you ask Marshall Crossing, she knows. They don't get scared away. But there's bananas! You said you are, but your meat isn't. No! You tricked me. I thought it was an apple! No, it was the opposite, okay. Huh. So he's trans me. Mod says that you're a trans me. What is this? Is this a banana? It looks squishy. It's squishy. Mmm. I can't tell, but I don't like the texture. Oh, it's fruit salad. And there's, like, bananas in it. So I have to, like, pick it out. And But every once in a while, I'll think that, like, a banana is a piece of apple. Because it's, like, they're the same color. Except maybe bananas have, like, those little lines. So right now, it was my fault. Because I didn't examine it closely enough. I like apples. I don't like bananas because they're so mushy and they're so dry. I like juicy fruits I like mango and papaya. That sounds good. Isn't it like almost midnight for you? He's taking all my nasty bananas. Oh my god, you ate so many of them, how? Ah. Oh, I was so... I was close.
Is this a banana? Yep. Is it are they gone? I've successfully picked out all of the bananas. <laughs> I feel like they should do it when they come out with the Switch so that we can port our catalog over to the Switch game when it comes out. Like how they did it for the DS and the Wii version. Are you gonna get Taco Bell for a midnight snack? done. There's one piece of banana that like managed to work its way in there. Bananas are the worst! No, I can't. They're so mushy and dry. Yeah, exactly! Marshall Crossing knows what's up. Y'all are disgusting. Night 177. Tell us about your thoughts on bananas. <laughs> I knew somebody was going to make a joke about that, but I, th to be fair, I thought it would be like an 11-year-old troll. Ew. Doodly dead. Sup. Tell us how you feel about bananas. I'm going to ask everybody this. <laughs> I don't think anybody likes wangs in their salad. Thanks for the follow, Night 177. Hokkaido Melon. Oh my god, I saw your. I was like looking at my followers list the other day because I was looking for someone. 
and I saw that you changed your picture to a picture of your profile picture to a picture of like Jocelyn Lousy. I was fucking dying. I was like cracking up so hard. Bye. Thank you. No, I don't know. It's not just that they're mushy. They're also dry. It's even worse because it's basically a soft, dry dick. <laughs> Amanda, sup? Amanda, tell us how you feel about bananas. You too, Hokkaido Melon. I'm going to start a poll. Bananas are disgusting, and if you don't agree with me, you like soft, dry dicks. Ew. Gross! You're all traitors! I like eggplants. Eggplants are delicious. Do not compare eggplants to bananas. Ew. I have no strong feelings about cucumbers. <gasps> Eggplants are so good. You know the problem is? I think it's because, like, that, um... In America, we call them an eggplant, but like in Europe, they call it like an aubergine, which sounds less offensive. Eating a banana is eating an old man's dick after he spent three years in the bath. Yes! Thank you, Marshall Crossing. <laughs> I remember that song from like. When was it? it? came out like when I was in third grade. Oh my god, I'm so old. The banana fandom gets heated. Are, is, are you trying to, like, type aubergine? We call it plant dicks. Yes, I think that's why Evan asked me about the eggplant. Like, eggplant parm is delicious. Or Baba Ganoush. I love Baba Ganoush. I feel like a bunch of y'all are gonna, like, go on my fucking Twitter and, like, my Instagram and send me, like, fucking, like, pictures of, like, nasty bananas. <laughs> Just to make me mad. <laughs> I said I was okay with cucumbers. I have no strong feelings about them. There's, like, um... An Asian dish, which is, like, made with cucumbers, and they make it with, like, a spicy sauce. It's, like, pretty good, actually. <gasps> Skish kebabs. Actually, you know what I get usually when I go to the Turkish place near me? Is lamb Madonna. Ah! I fucking scared it away! I thought you were getting ready for sleep! Yo, do you guys remember in the fourth grade when, like, Bath and Body Works, their most popular scent was cucumber melon or whatever? Mine is three inches. <laughs> so, I actually, I like peaches because peaches are, like, um, a, like, juicy fruit. Um, my first time ever I had peaches, like, I didn't know that, like, you could map reset for your fruit and all that. So I ended up getting peaches. I was okay. At first I was kind of mad because I wanted the apples because they're shiny. But then like an incident happened with a friend. 
He got drunk. He showed his ass to everyone. Uh, I'm not going to tell the whole story because he's not here to defend himself. So, uh, the peach thing has kind of, like, turned into an inside joke. My favorite fruits are actually mangoes. Madonna old and she's still making music. She is. Adonna or Hoagie. Actually, no. I like when I get, when I get lamb Adonna. I love, I like to get it with, like, uh, rice because it comes with, like, hot sauce. Um... Or I just, I like to put the hot sauce, like, in with the... Maybe it's an Asian thing. I just like rice. I don't know. I just... But I prefer it with rice. I'm supposed to... Uh, you're gonna be so... I hope you don't have work tomorrow or anything. Say so see me peach, but yes. Peaches, well, yeah, that, that was a joke. Peaches look like butts. I like watermelons, but... Unfortunately, they're not as good for you as other fruits like mango, papaya. Because um, there's, like, no fibers. It's literally just, like, water and sugar. But they taste really good. Uh, oh, here's the... oh, well, well, then stay up all night and ask me weird questions about bananas. We do love basic white rice. <laughs> Rice is good. I literally, I remember when, like, I was in college, and we were, like, we went to tour, like, all these colleges. Grapes do look like balls, but I also, I don't mind grapes because they're juicy. <laughs> um, but anyway, so, when we were eating, and you, like, because, like, college, you know, cafeteria style, you go, you get your food, or whatever, and I was, like, looking for the rice, so I asked one of the employees where the rice was, and they were like, oh, we don't have any today. I was like, you don't have any today? And they were like, yeah, they don't, like, have it every day or whatever, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, you don't have rice every day? And they were like, no. I literally, I went home to my parents, and I was like, you cannot send me off to college. They don't eat rice every day. Who doesn't have rice every day? Juicy balls. Actually, if you, like, um... There, like, act, uh, so, my mom, there is, like, Chinese sausages, lap chang, which I don't, I hate them. They're, like, wait, okay, I'm gonna find a picture for you guys. It just, they look, dis they just look disgusting. If pizza is a vegetable... Anything can be a vegetable. They're heathens! Who doesn't eat rice every day? Oh, okay. So, look at it! Look at that! Look at that! And tell me that that does not look disgusting! But you're old enough to look at. Ecuadorian sausage peaches I hate it look at it just just tell me tell me it doesn't look disgusting Ooh golden stag What are you eating right now? Well, yeah, if, if pizza's a vegetable. I'm, like, I'm mostly Chinese with, like, the tiniest bit of, like, Southeast Asian. I mean, like, enough to make me dark. That's it. <laughs> But anyway, my friend Maria would make fun of me because, like, I wouldn't, one time we were, like, at my friend Vicky's house, and her mom gave it to me because I'm Asian, so, like, she thought I would fucking eat it. And then Maria doesn't eat it because Maria's a vegan. And I was, like, how? I was, like, no. They're disgusting. They look disgusting. I don't know if any of you clicked on the link. Just, just look at it. But anyway, so because I 
have mostly, like, most of the guys I've dated, like, are either, like, Puerto Rican <laughs> or some type of, like, European slash Spanish. Basically not Asian. So, Maria, like, in front of, like, uh, Vicky's mom was like, oh, you know, <laughs> she was like, you don't like Asian men. You don't like Asian sausages. And I was like, and her mom, like, didn't get the joke because, like, she's fine. What if you buy the popcorn that, like, what if you, like, buy the kind that you pop in the, like, in the pot by yourself? Is that better? Is that, like, a group, is there, like, a group called Famous Teenagers? Or are you just asking if I know any <laughs> Famous Teenagers? I think popcorn is, like, probably better for you than, like, most other snacks you could eat. But I don't, I don't think it's, like, good for you. I love fried plantains. <laughs> but I won't eat bananas. It's okay, because they're fried in syrup and cinnamon. I don't like popcorn either, but I'm not, I'm not repulsed by popcorn, like how I'm repulsed by bananas. I just feel like when you eat it, like, it's filled with salt, and then, like, the kernels get stuck in your teeth. Um, I think you can send it. I think the ma, I think I can approve, I think if you send it, the mod can approve it. Yeah! I've eaten popcorn before because I'm not repulsed by popcorn the same way that I'm repulsed by bananas. Um, type it so that it's Instagram.com slash space name and then people can delete it. Oh, Marsha, that is disgusting! Why? No, I hate pickles. I hate pickles. Or, I hate pickles. No. <laughs> Everybody is finding out all my weird, like, food eating habits right now. <laughs> Pickles are disgusting. Ice cream is good. Bananas are not. I hate pickles. And I hate olives. I don't like sour food, so anything that's like... Pickled or... For me to... <gasps> I love caramel. And cheesecake! <gasps> cheesecake is so good. Pickles? What kind of wangs are you looking at? That pickles? That pickles look like a wang. Hokkaido Melon, do not make me ban you. Cheesecake is delicious. I said I was okay with eggplants. <laughs> I don't mind, like, Italian sausages, like, the, you know, but, like, these dried up shits, I can't. Ah, oh, fuck, I scared something away. All he said was Reddit. Wait, okay, I lost, what was her name? I'm whoa, Vicky. All right, let me. Do I wanna? I'm afraid now. Uh. 
It says that she's followed by Black China. Oh, well, I just had fruit salad, but I didn't eat, like, the whole thing because, like, over half of it was, like, bananas. So I picked it out. Eric also likes the town of sausages. I know. Am I... Okay, wait, is this the video that I'm watching? Should I turn the sound on? I don't know. What am I doing? Am I, am I watching the video? I don't understand, like, is she gonna pull out a banana? I like peanut butter, but I can't, I don't like bananas. Because they're disgusting. You're all heathens. Y'all need Jesus. I like waffles. Waffles are good. You y'all need Jesus. <laughs> I like apples. mind them. Like, apple picking is pretty fun. Where did Marsha go? She was the only one that, like, backed me up in my, like, hate for banana. Really? You like bananas but not Doritos? Blasphemy. No. Like, why Why did Jesus, like, make a banana? Like, why Why did he think that we needed that? Well, I didn't make a banana. The banana... Ooh, golden stag. Oh god, did you choke on, like, the crumbs or something? <laughs> I got- yeah, oranges are good. Why Bob Ross? What do you have against Bob Ross? <laughs> what did he ever do to you? Ooh, did you have the Taco Bell? Um, the Taco Bell. The Dorito Taco? <laughs> Bob Ross mods once timed me out because I typed command discord in the chat because I subbed. Wait, why did they do what do they have something against discord? I don't understand why they would time you out, right? 
Because I only recently got a Discord, um, but before that, when people would do it, I would just be like, I don't have Discord, sorry. Send Jocelyn Wildstein after his people. She'll make them pay. So I probably shouldn't tell you that, like, Bob Ross is on Netflix, I feel like. <laughs> oh my god, I'm dying. I When I woke up this morning, I thought that it was just my allergies. I took two Allegra. My nose is still fucking running. I'm pretty sure that, like, I'm, I'm having, like, an air conditioner. I'm coming down with an air conditioner cold. Yeah, unless they took it off. Um, but it was up at one. It was on. Bob Ross was on Netflix at one point. But I think it's only like one season. Are you gonna report him now and get him removed from Netflix? Actually, I knew a kid next to me that did eat loose leaf paper, and he ate glue. And he ate, like, the pencil shavings from the pencil sharpener. With bananas? Everybody, else, everybody got weirded out about my our conversation about bananas. They left us. Or well, they thought I was crazy. Which I'm not. Bananas are evil. Wait, was it the guy from Powerpuff Girls? That blue guy? Mojo Jojo? They love bananas more than they love me! Thank you. Look, there's a piece of banana in the bowl if you want to eat it. <laughs> Does she- will she join me in my hatred for bananas? Otherwise, I'm uninterested. Not always, um, this is the, it's the main thing I stream, but I also do Smash, Splatoon, especially like Salmon Run, um, Mario Kart, I have a couple of Mario Party streams, uh, which I did a collab with some other streamers that were like really fun. I tried Fortnite, um, a, a little while back. We're trying to get the PS4 set up so that I can stream some PS4 games. I'm hoping to do a Double Dash stream soon. The nerd that eats glue in kindergarten. I don't remember that. I remember Mojo Jojo. And like the lady that like you could never see her face. It wasn't kindergarten, it was like, maybe like the fourth grade. And then he went from like, eating glue to sniffing it. I, I don't think that was much of an improvement. Woo! Thank you for the follow to the tag, you scared me. <laughs> the sound scared me, it was really loud. Nobody remembers side characters, okay. Thank you! What am I? Nerd from Power Puff Girls. 
who ate glue. That's hysterical, but no, this kid was black. <laughs> But wait, his name was Elmer Skulu, and he appeared in the episode Paste Makes Waste. Yeah, it was super loud! <laughs> it startled me. Every once in a while, I think, like, sometimes we, sometimes, like, it's, so, like, low, and I don't hear it. It gets turned off by mistake, so they'll make it, like, the, the mod will make it, like, louder so I can hear it, but then sometimes it'll be too loud, and it'll, like, fucking scare the shit out of me. Yeah. There were no Asian people in it. I think. No, uh, yeah, no. Not here. Thank you, Evan. <laughs> and for new renewing your subscription earlier. <laughs> the ghoul guy? I want to watch the Powerpuff Girls now. I wonder if it's on Netflix. I wouldn't have done it. It's gross. <laughs> I don't have Hulu. I'm too poor to own more than one subscription, so I did not need to start creeping that early. Hulu is everything now. I feel like I should leave Netflix for them. Because they took off. It's always sunny in Philadelphia, but Hulu hasn't right now. Yeah, every time I want to watch a show, it's like, it's off of Netflix and it's on Hulu. I think, wait, does Hulu have, um, Orphan Black? I know Amazon Prime has it. What is that? <gasps> I have 201 followers, guys! Thank you so much uh, to everybody that followed me before and today. Now we're going to have a debate on which is better, Hulu or Netflix. <gasps> Wait, I thought Netflix had everything Disney. No? Orphan Black? Well, like, it depends on the contracts that they can get and what Netflix is willing to pay out. But I also heard that Disney wants to do their own streaming service. Still salty. But if Disney is going to have their own streaming service that, and they're going to pull their stuff like from Netflix, they better have, if they want me to sign up for their service, they better have everything on there. Everything.
But yeah, but that's my point. If they want me, I, right now I only have Netflix, but if Disney wants me to sign up, like, for their own thing, it needs to have all their shows, all their movies, and, uh, oh. I'm about to like I had to it was a golden stag um but anyway I'm about to like si make another email to sign up for a uh, free trial of Amazon Prime so that I can freaking watch Orphan Black on it I used to use my ex-friend's account and then she dumped me because when I watch stuff I like to watch it with like the subtitles on because sometimes I whisper they like they talk really fast or if they have like a foreign accent I have no idea what they said. And then I'm like, was it important to the plot line? Oh, I see an oak silk moth. I don't have one of those yet. No, she can suck my left nut. Yeah, new museum edition. Ad edition? A, not an E. So... She had flaked on me a couple times before when we were supposed to hang out. Um, or, like, if I made plans with her, she would take forever to show up. The left one is bigger. I don't know. Um, <laughs> um, so, it really bugged me because, like, you know, she, like, goes to school and work on time, so I know she's capable of showing up for shit on time, but, you know, and she was like, oh, but you're my friend, so you should be more understanding, blah, 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 you're not, like, my boss or a professor, and I was like, okay, but as your friend, it's disrespectful, you know, like, I value your time, you should value my time, um, so, like, there was one day where she was supposed to meet me at 12, and because she had done this a few times, at 11 o'clock, when I was supposed to uh, go to the city, she, um, because she had done this a couple of times, sorry, yeah, you have to donate at least 20 items to the museum, one item in each category, so the fish, bugs, and art. Um, but anyway, so she had done this before, so at 11 o'clock, I messaged her to be like, hey, I'm getting on the train, I'm about to leave my house and get on the train, are you ready? She didn't answer me. Blah, blah, blah. She woke, I, She messaged me maybe at like 1.30. How she just woke up. She was really sorry. Blah, blah, blah. Could we still hang out? So I was like, I already woke up. Got dressed. I drew my fucking eyebrows on. Fine, just hurry the fuck up. You know? So she pushed it like to like 3 so that she could like have time to get ready. Whatever. But then like she, her mom wanted her help her with stuff. And then she was like, oh my god. Like, I wish I woke up on time, because then, like, she would have been gone. She wouldn't be asking me to do this. And I'm like, I know, bitch! I wish you woke up on time, too! Um, 
So, ooh, did I donate this one to the museum? I don't think I did. No, I scared it away, motherfucker! Anyway, so, uh, sorry, I don't. I had one earlier, but I gave it to the guy, but he didn't even drop the thing he was supposed to trade, and the Wi-Fi is acting up. Um, anyway. She was like, I'll make it up to you, blah, blah, blah. So finally, my birthday month comes, and the restaurant that I like to do, you have to go to Crazy Red. Google Tonky, uh, the Crazy Red guy, it's very helpful. So, my the restaurant that I like to go to for my birthday, you have to book it at least a month in advance. Last year, I don't know whose Wi-Fi it was. Somebody's Wi-Fi. It could be mine because streaming takes up so much bandwidth. So, last year, I literally waited one... No, Google Tonky, there should o there's always at least one real painting. <laughs> Watching him. I'm going to I'm going to send you his uh profile later and you can send Jocelyn while seen after him. Um, oh no, not a tour. <laughs> My precious painting. Anyway, so, she, like, oh, anyway, last year, I booked the restaurant. I tried doing it, like, three weeks instead of four. And they were out until, like, they were, like, oh, yeah, our next table is at the end of April. I was, like, okay, that's unhelpful. That's a whole entire month after my birthday. So, this year, I booked it six weeks in advance because I was so paranoid that they would be booked solid again. Um... So she had six weeks to, like, I give, this is why I get mad when people don't text me back about it. Because I give you at least a month to fucking request off from work, visit your grandmother, whatever shit you gotta fucking do before you're allowed to go out of the fucking house. Okay? So I knew that she was like, I could tell she was hesitant about not coming, about coming to my party. I could tell she didn't want to come. But she wouldn't say it. So I messaged people two weeks before, a week before, three days before. The day before and the day of, because I've been ghosted many times. Don't ghost people, it's very shitty. But anyway, I texted her, so from the two-week mark, she didn't answer me, and I would be annoyed because I would see her on Snapchat and Instagram, so I know her phone fucking works! So I would see her online. Um... Finally, like, the day of, I messaged her. I'm like, hey, I've sent you, like, six messages. Are you coming tonight or not? And she was like, I'm really sorry. I'm not in the mood. I was like, okay, it's fine that you're not in the mood. But I literally have been after you the past two weeks about this. And you tell me now that you're not in the mood for it? Like, you could have told me that, like, two weeks ago when I asked you. It would have been fine. But now I'm mad because I'm running. I'm wasting all my time running after you for this. She didn't say anything. I was pissed because I saw on Snapchat. You know, so again, your phone works, you ignored my messages for two weeks, and, you know, now this bullshit, whatever. So, she ended up blocking me on everything, and I think like a couple months ago, when I went to Starbucks near my job for a coffee break, I ran into her, and she looked terrified. I, like, wanted to spill my coffee on her so bad. Alright, we're donating the oak silk moth. We're going to freak out Blathers, because he doesn't like them. If I find any duplicates, I will. I wish, but like, you can get like in a lot of trouble for that, because it's not just considered like, an assault, like, if the cops would be called, because, like, your spit carries, like, germs, you could have, like, a viral, viral, like, disease or whatever, so they can, like, charge you with, like, fucking, t it's, like, 
it's it's not just assault. It's assault with a deadly weapon because you could have like a you could potentially have a deadly disease. Wait, have you used the Tonky Guide, or do you just buy it blind? It's not worth it. Just seeing, like, the look of, like, terror on her face and running into me better. It's actually funny you say that because she did gain, like, a lot of weight. And she made, like, a Facebook post, like, complaining about people talking about her weight. Are those dark circles under your eyes, Kathy? That means you're not getting enough rest. I recommend healthy 14 hours sleep per night with plenty of naps. It's going to go throughout the day. Okay, whatever, Mom. Okay, no, don't buy random stuff. Hold on a second. Use that guy to help you. Oh yeah, I forgot. We went to visit the cafe, but we didn't do the ceremony for like... Ooh, Lily! i just rather type flowers and fucking person. Would you like to try? Uh, sure. Why not? Uh, my favorite flower are peonies, but I guess I'll say daisies. Very interesting. Lily... Oh, should I pick the lilies? Because Lily asked me. Daisies signify... Signif... Signif... Oh my god, I can't say that. Innocence and hope! You must be pretty optimistic, Kathy. What do you think? I bet you didn't know flowers could tell you all of that. No. That bitch blocked me. I don't give a shit anymore. <laughs> I'm done! She's dead to me. I, like, maybe looked at it once, like, around the time she, like, you know, did this. But after that, I was like, whatever. I don't need her. Because then she was, like, going in our mutual group of friends and, like, talking shit about me. Um... So, like, this was, like, a little before, like, this was, like, a couple weeks before. Significant. Sign yeah, significant. Signif right? That's, like, a weird word to say. Um, hello everyone. Welcome to the grand completion of Ceremony for Hogwarts Vital Cafe Project. Thank you for joining us for this momentous occasion. I'm Isabel and I'll be your host today. Thank you, thank you. You're too kind. We're going to keep this short and sweet, so let's jump right in. First up, we have an incredibly short speech from our very own mayor. Well said, Mayor, you have quite a way with words. Okay, moving on. That concludes the summer. Thanks everyone for all of your hard work and taking time out of your skip busy so I just be out. Sig significant significant Wait, what did I say? I'm so confused! How did I pass AP in how did I get a ninety nine AP English? Because I clearly can't pronounce like words that like which I'm pretty sure like are taught to like fourth graders. Gabe, sup? Gabe, tell us what you think about bananas. Alright, I'm gonna try opening my gates again.
Yeah, old man dicks. Ugh. No. <laughs> We started talking about bananas again. What the fuck? You guys are perverts. Hokkaido Melon, go find um, Jocelyn Wildstein's social media and or send her a letter. Just be like, we have to know what you think about bananas. Um, I already opened the gate, I think. But if you want to add me for like in the future. Actually, you know what? I'll put this in storage. Um, to get my friend code is command FC 3DS. So I can carry my beetles. She got remarried? To who? Exclamation FC 3DS. That was fucking loud. It's not even dark enough to see fireworks. What the fuck? Uh okay, I don't know. Were you were you hoping for a chance? <laughs> Oh, it's working for once. Yes, there we go. Who the, do I want to know what that guy looks like? Give me your uh, friend code so I can add you for next time. In bananas! Alright, Gabe, where are you? You can just drop it by the train station. Oh, thank you. Let me see. But unfortunately, I'm going to be getting offline after I sell my loot because tomorrow I have work early and late. 
Um, Norma is scanned into the RV if you want to visit. What's fine? Did I donate a rainbow sack? I think I did. Bells. Wednesday. I got a hammer. Like Thor. Wednesday, um... I'll let, yeah, I'll let some people in on Wednesday after I take care of, like, you know, like, the money rock, fossils, placing public, you know, stuff that you can't do. If you fill my house with bananas, I will hunt you down and I will kill you. Um, but yeah, Wednesday is okay. They can't prove anything. Um, yeah, you can sell your perfect fruit, but if um, make sure they're not peaches, otherwise it's gonna you're gonna make the same amount of money as you would selling it in your regular town. No, it's not. Um, yeah, you can sell them in my town then. Ugh. Alright, Gabe, I'm gonna be ending. Oh, wait, are you, Gabe, where are you? Are you with Norma? Or are you just like wandering around my town? Oh, I didn't see what you said because I was going inside. Selling. Oh, okay. Therese? Right, I can pay off my home loan. I'm going to end up spending all these bells. <laughs> um, if you're doing something like selling like perfect fruit in my town, I wouldn't mind like a small tip. 
or something like that. But if you're giving it, just give it to me. Don't give it to me, like, if you need your bells. <laughs> Do I? I'm scared. I, like, I don't want to Google that guy. Ooh. This is what you had to do. <laughs> Look at their faces. Wait. Wait, the funny part is, like, they don't get mad. Wait, can you not talk to them while you're holding it? Oh, no, you can't. Alright, let's harass some more of my other villagers. Sterling, I haven't seen you in a while, I feel like. Let's go talk to him. I have no idea what's going on outside. The point is that these clothes look old. Yep, that's the point. Okay. You didn't say anything else? What's up? Lady Do, I think I reached a new level of metaphysical fitness during cardio training yesterday. From where I think it went white, then beyond the light, I saw an image tab falling by. It's crazy. It felt like I had reached a new place. Plane of muscle consciousness. Or maybe I was just dizzy at the cartwheeling all over the place. <laughs> Thank you. Wait, I don't have a clapping one? I don't have a clapping one yet. I can drag there. Ooh, maybe I should place a public works project. I need, I'm thinking of placing like a tulip topiary like here. Well, like here and here. I feel like it would look good. Okay. I'm gonna mark it with the thing. Okay, uh, Gabe, thank you for, oh my god, stop, thank you for all the bells. I'm going to be placing a public works project and then ending the stream.
God damn it, it didn't fucking save because we got disconnected. This is going to be such a pain in the ass. I feel like that's something you do if you're super desperate, like, all your shit is broken. <laughs> Otherwise, it seems, like, unnecessarily, like, difficult. They're being so fucking loud outside, I'm gonna kill them. Yeah, but I was gonna say, but even then, like, are you really that desperate? Oh, see, it would be cool if I could put something, like, right here in between them, but I can't. It is trash. I'm really annoyed about that, just because... They didn't freaking give us Netflix on the Switch, because Netflix on the Wii U is fine. It, but, like, the 3DS, like, who's really watching? Like you said, we would watch that shit on our smartphones. Really? They took a time to develop an app? For that, but not for the Switch. I'm so angry. I mean, on the Wii, it's fine, I think, right? Oh, no, I've never done on the Wii, but the Wii U, I remember it being, like, not that annoying. <laughs> Gabe, you can give her the bells that you gave to me because I lost them when you DC'd. Oh yeah, I didn't even check my town initiatives. I keep forgetting. Dream sharing. Interior design. Yeah, it did. I 
Are they still out there fighting? Nah. The other guy has a chicken. What happened? The other guy has a chicken. The fat guy? Yeah. <sighs> Start a new project. Right. There's Hulu wants but What? I call bullshit. Isabel, let's move. It's late. It's actually the time I set the 3DS clock to in real life now. Um, we're gonna place it. No, I just have to get her to like position it the way I want. No. I gotta go from the left. Okay. I'm so happy they made it so much easier to play shit in this game. Oh, well, with the Welcome Amiibo update. Sell off the last of our bugs, and then we can pay it off tonight. Is he still? That's why that dickhole isn't watching my stream right now. Go to stream and tell him play Animal Crossing. Good evening. I contribute to a campaign to fund a tulip topiary, a target fund is I. Right. Oh, offline. Send a message and tell them to play Animal Crossing. Alright, we caught enough to pay that off. Elgato offline. What is that? Wait, leave the door open. I want to try to update the dream address. Guys, pray for me.
Oh my god! Oh, I turned it off because I was sneezing. Oof, it's Kirby. Um, priority for online play goes to uh, my subs and followers, but I'm actually getting off line. Um, but I will be doing a little bit of online play on Wednesday. Oh, I was earlier. <laughs> he was telling me about drama with the neighbors. Okay, guys. I do host Eric. Um, we all... I do host Eric. Um, but he's a butt wipe. Anyway, guys. I'm getting off now. Follow me if you haven't already um on twitch and my youtube instagram twitter all that stuff is linked below if you want to see what i'm doing when i am not here streaming good night guys i love you bye